The Las Vegas Raiders are working out free agent linebacker Jalen Smith, according to Jordan Schultz. And I'm excited about this. Let's, let's get into this report here. Jordan Schultz said the following. He said sources uh, are telling him that free agent linebacker Jalen Smith is working out for the Raiders right now. Um, and it's kind of interesting if you guys think about this because uh, Jalen Smith has a little bit of experience with Patrick Graham. Uh, Patrick Graham in 2021 actually brought in uh, uh, Jalen Smith here. And that's kind of interesting because now the Raiders are working him out again. Um, I've, saw, I've seen a lot of people kind of talking about how this guy could instantly improve some of our linebackers. Uh, right now, we're not 100% sure what's kind of going on with Divine Diablo. And outside of Diablo, uh, we don't really know how the groups can kind of shape up, right? We have guys like Robert Spillane. We have guys like um, Darian Butler and Luke Masterson, who were rookies last year. We don't really know what they'll be this year. Curtis Bolton, right? Really didn't hear much from him last season, but he had a little bit of upside, right, in the past. Um, and then we just picked up Darius Harris, Darius Harris from the Kansas City Chiefs. So the Raiders have some interesting linebackers, but we're not 100% sure with the group this season. Then you consider Divine Diablo. We don't know what's kind of going on there. And at that point, the Raiders may need a little bit of help. Right. And Jalen Smith could make sense. But I am going to be honest uh, about this. You know, I don't like to, you know, I don't like to stay every player the Raiders bring in work out is going to work out for the Raiders. Um, and Jalen Smith, I feel like is an interesting player because, you know, last season, I remember watching certain teams playing the Giants. Uh, I remember watching the Packers offensive line, the Philadelphia offensive line, and the Dallas Cowboys offensive lines against the Giants. And I remember Jalen Smith. Didn't look very good, right? He didn't look very explosive. And I know that stuck out to me right away because Jalen Smith was one of those guys I really, really liked when he was younger in his career, right? In his first three to four seasons when he was with the Cowboys, the guy was a, a, a star, man. I mean, he, he got a massive contract, I think, after like his second or third season because that's the type of, you know, upside this guy could have potentially had. And for whatever reason, it just never worked, right? He slowed down pretty quickly. And I think... Maybe it was the injury he had before he got into the NFL, right? I believe it was uh, in his final season in college, he ended up getting hurt. But regardless, the guy's not the same player he was in his first three to four seasons, right? So for me, I don't know what he can provide to the Raiders at this point, but I will also state this, you know, there are always benefits with, with certain guys, right? And I think with Jalen Smith, uh, the thing you would bring, you would get with a guy like Jalen Smith if you brought him in is you, you get, you get a guy that's a veteran, right? He's in year seven at this point. Uh, he's played a lot of snaps in the NFL. He's played in a couple of different schemes at this point, but he's also played in the Patrick Graham scheme, right? Patrick Graham was the coach that kind of brought him in. Um, after he got cut, right? He, he went from the Cowboys in 2021. Uh, the Cowboys cut him. The Packers picked him up. They cut him midseason. And then the Giants brought him in, right? Patrick Grant brought him in and kind of revived him a little bit, right? But we'll see what ends up happening, right? Maybe the Raiders think that this guy could provide him some value. Um, and at the very least, you know, he could come in. He can kind of help some of the younger guys. He can teach them some of the things he's learned, you know, or as, you know, he's been in the NFL and, and, and those type of things. Um, plus, at the very end of it, you know, if you get eight linebackers in a linebacker group during camp, you know, four or five are going to come out, right? So at the very, very least, it's just one of those, you know, you turn every single stone over and possibly get a guy in Jalen Smith that has upside, very least he ends up getting cut, right? So either way, you know, I, I like the fact that we're bringing in certain guys um, because even yesterday, the Raiders brought in two running backs. We brought in Rex Burkhead and we brought in Damian Williams. These are running backs that have spent time with the New England Patriots. These are guys that know the Josh McDaniel scheme. Now, it's kind of interesting to think about this, right? Um, because to me, Rex Burkhead kind of fits that same role as Amir Abdullah, who the Raiders already have. You know, and I, I don't see us needing two of these same type of guys, right? These are role players, right? These are guys that are going to come in on third downs. Uh, they'll they'll pass block, they'll release, and they know kind of the, the pass blocking aspect of things. But we don't need two of these guys. So bringing in Rex Burkhead, maybe tell you what, what this regime may be thinking about Amir Abdullah. But even beyond that, what about Damian Williams? I think that's an interesting pick. Is, is that kind of, you know, hinting that maybe uh, Zamir White or uh, Austin Walter or Sincere McCormick or one of these other guys isn't living up to being that true, you know, change of pace running back. Is that what that would kind of mean, right? Because to me, Damon Williams isn't a true third down running back. He's not a guy that's going to make a whole lot of plays out of the backfield. 
He's more so of an in-between the tackle running back, right? He's Josh Jacobs is a mere white type of back, right? I don't know. It's kind of interesting to hear that the Raiders are working these running backs out. We also got another report yesterday that Josh Jacobs and the Raiders, right, may be open to some talks from the Raiders side, right? Uh, I don't know. It's just kind of interesting to, to hear that the Raiders are working out running backs. Because anytime you bring in running backs, you got to cut other running backs, right? You're not going to have a running back room of 12 running backs, right? So, I don't know. It's an interesting report regardless. Let me know what you guys think. Should the Raiders sign any of these three players? Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Training camp is officially underway. And I'm excited, man. It's the best time of the year. So, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Thumbs up, subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time with another video.